Hi, my name is Jules Bennett, and I have been attending the Life Recovery Group for a little over a year since January of last year. Our marriage before the day of the uh, last confrontation was very lonely. I felt very isolated and alone and not chosen, not cherished, not loved, and I felt helpless and hopeless. My life at the time was without God. He always said that he loved me, but I didn't always feel that way because we were having sex, but it was just to me sex to satisfy him. I didn't even feel like I was in the room sometimes. I felt like we weren't really communicating. We didn't talk about how we felt with one another for fear that that would stir something up. Well, early on in our relationship, I had found some pictures that made me feel inadequate that I wasn't enough for him, that he had to look for other avenues to, to find his uh, gratification in our relationship. I would just suppress everything and see how everything goes and just go along. And whether it was months later or years later, then I'd find it again. In November of 2018, about a week before Thanksgiving, um, I found, I felt like I was led to sit down at his computer for some reason and there was pornography there. And I texted him and I said, get in the house now, all caps. From the look on his face, it looked like he knew when he came in the house that he knew what I wanted to talk to him about. But I told him that I was so hurt. I think he finally saw how hurt I was. We found a, um, a marriage counselor and a Christian marriage counselor and he encouraged us to seek out a group. I walked into the room with uh, the group of ladies that were there and I felt, I was very raw at the time, but I felt welcomed. I found a place where um, of safety and security with women that had been through similar situations. And with these ladies, I found that intimacy is uh, being known and knowing, and that you can actually have an intimate relationship with God. Finding a life recovery group made me realize that I'm not alone in my struggles. I'm not alone in my brokenness, in my worries, in my hurt. Today, I feel loved, cherished, chosen. My relationship with my husband now is very um, open and honest and full of understanding because we can talk about everything we feel. Uh, we can talk about God and how much God has helped us to change our life. If you've just discovered your husband has been unfaithful to you and you're feeling hopeless and helpless and isolated, I just want you to know that there is a place for you to go there where there's, there's hope and there's other ladies that have been through what you're going through that help you to see that you're not alone in the struggle, that there is hope and that there is help, and that when you trust in the Lord that everything's going to be okay.